this is one of those oddball things that the Italians came up with in the Second World War. Um, Breeder machine gun, that's B-R-E-D-A. It looked a bit like a 50 caliber in that it had twin spade grips, mounted on a tripod. Um, captured examples were mounted on vehicles on a pintle mount. And the Italians had them on vehicles on a pintle mount. But it was never a light machine gun. It never had a bipod or a stock. It was always a tripod mounted machine gun with two spade grips like a 50 caliber. Unfortunately, unlike the 50 caliber, it wasn't belt fed. They had these weird 20 round feed clips and they would be issued 10 in a wooden box. I've got a wooden box for them somewhere in the shed. Wooden box with a cloth handle. You'd open the wooden box and there'd be 10 in the box. They'd come ready filled with ammunition and what would happen was, and this is where the breeder was quite a really shit machine gun, as the clip was put into the side of the machine gun, didn't have a belt, it had a feed clip, the clip was put into the side of the breech, as the gun was fired, it would pull the clip through the breech of the gun as it fired. Now you would think, as it fired, a full clip would go in, an empty clip would come out, ready to be refilled again. Nope. The breeder machine gun was a weird thing in that as it pulled the clip through it lifted each round out of the clip it then fired the bullet and then the mechanism put the empty cartridge back into the clip again and that happened every single time the round was fired so you'd start off with a full clip of ammunition as it was fed through the gun the gun picked up each individual round, fired the bullet, put the case back, fired the bullet, put the case back, so that when you got to the other side of the breech, the loader had a tray full of fired cartridges. And in order to use the tray again, if you didn't have another full tray immediately to hand, in order to use the tray, you'd have to manually remove each of the fired cartridges and put a new one back in. So you have to manually refill them again complete waste of energy and a waste of time but don't know why they did it but that was a peculiarity of the breeder machine gun so that's the breeder machine gun ammunition clip in this instance because italian ammunition is fairly rare in england these this is filled for display purposes with german 7.92 which was the closest i could get so that's got german 7.92 in but it's a 20 round world war ii breeder machine gun ammo clip it was a standard um sort of medium machine gun of the italian army whereas we had the vickers the americans had the 30 caliber 1919 variants the italians had the breeder quite a wasteful design method so you start off with a full clip like that as it passed through the breach of the gun it picked up each individual round fired the bullet put the cartridge case back in the tray so that when you got to the other side of the breech the loader had a case full of empty fire cartridges so that's what that is just one of those weird things of world war ii see you later